everyone my name is chisum i have um, a message for us today yes i have a very important message for us across the world today um that message is going to be taken from the book of isaiah 35 verse 4 i will read out for us to hear the bible says in isaiah 35 verse 4 say to them that are of a fearful heart be strong fear not behold your God will come with vengeance. Even God with a recompense, he will come and save you. Okay, what is the message here? I want to tell us that God says we should not fear. Though the world is, the whole world now is in panic because of the coronavirus pandemic, yes. But we should not fear. That is the word of God. He says we should not fear. The God, our credo, is going to come and save us he promised he's going to come and save us he says he will come and save save us and he's the one that says the things and gets it done heaven and every pass away but the word of god does not pass away so i want to tell us this moment that even as we are staying at home we really do not have any much to distract us um from getting closer to god this is a very good opportunity for us to Go to God, remind him of his prophecies, remind him of his promises in the scripture, um, all the word he has said to us. And this is actually a good time for us to call upon the name of the Lord for rescue. Yes, we we'll call upon him. The Bible said, if my people who are called by my name will humble themselves and pray and turn away from their wickedness, the Bible said the Lord is going to hear us from heaven and he is going to heal our land. So if we can stop fearing and start calling upon the name of the Lord. Trust me, he's going to heal the world. He is the one that has the power to heal the world because he's the one that created the world. Yes, coronavirus is very deadly. It has the power to kill. But trust me, God in heaven has the power to make a life. Even for those of us that are already sick on the hospital bed, I am telling you this hour is that if we can stop fearing, remove fear, remove panicking, remove every sort of fear from our mind. Rather, let us build our faith, draw closer to God, call upon his name. He says he will come and save us. He is going to come and save the world from this deadly virus. Let us call upon the name of the Lord. Even now that we are at home, let us call upon the name of the Lord, the name of our Savior, for him to come down and rescue the world. That is what I have to share with us today. Thank you so much for listening as we begin to call upon the name of the Lord. Thank you very much. And please consider subscribing to this YouTube channel. I'll be posting videos every Saturday. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Bye.